Hi guys. Today we are discussing a pharmacology video that is COMT and COMT inhibitors. That is catechol O methyl transferase and COMT inhibitors that are drugs used to inhibit catechol O methyl transferase. So we'll be dealing with what is COMT, what are the functions of COMT. What are the conversions or the reactions catalyzed by COMT, COMT inhibitors and its use, side effects. Now, what is COMT? Catechol O methyl transferase is one of the several enzymes that degrade catecholamines. So, we have dealt with MAO and MAO inhibitors. COMT and MAO are two enzymes which do the same property which have the same property and do the same mechanism that is degradation of catecholamines and involved in the mechanism of catecholamine degradation such as dopamine, epinephrine and norepinephrine. Also catechol estrogens and various drugs and substances that is having a catechol structure. So COMT will be degrading the catecholamine structure having neurotransmitters, neurotransmitters having catecholamine structures, catechol estrogens etc. In humans, COMT is encoded by a COMT gene. There is a special COMT gene. COMT was first discovered by biochemist Julius Axelrod in 1957. It is produced by the nerve cells in the brain and also by liver cells. Now, the functions of COMT. Catechol or methyl transferase is involved in the inactivation of the catecholamine neurotransmitters present excess in the synapse. So, we have been discussing the MAO inhibitors and MAO. They were also doing the same process at the synapse. The enzyme introduces a methyl group that is methyl transferase, methyl group to the catecholamine which is donated by s adenosyl methionine SAM. We have been discussing with the SAM and we have studied about the SAM in the biochemistry or in the pharmacology where we have studied biotransformation. Biotransformation. So, in biotransformation 2, we have actually studied about the conjugation reactions, right? This S adenosyl methionine is a methylating agent present in the biotransformation, which is mainly happening in the liver and also some parts in kidney. So, any compound having a catechol structure like catechol estrogen or catechol containing flavonoids are the substrates of COMT, and COMT will be introducing a methyl group. So, it is known as methyl transferase to a catechol that is catechol or methyl transferase. Levodopa, a precursor of catecholamines is an important substrate of COMT. So the reactions of COMT, dopamine will be converted to 3-methoxypyramine, dopac will be converted to HBA, norepinephrine to normethanephrine, epinephrine to methanephrine and dopec, dopic to mopic and doma to VMA. We have to study these compounds and the norepinephrine is this was asked in the previous exam. How does COMT work on norepinephrine and the body's byproduct? This was asked in the previous exam. So this is catechol or methyl transferase enzyme that is catecholamine which is active. Then by S adenosyl methionine, which is a methylene agent, in the presence of COMT, they will be adding a methyl group. So this is inactive. So norepinephrine will be converted to by MAO, this conversion happens and by COMT, this conversion happens. This is a cycle which is having MAO and COMT action and you can refer this. So active catecholamines are added a methyl group by SAM and COMT and converted to inactive metabolite. COMT inhibitors. So sometimes there are drugs called COMT inhibitors which inhibits the action of COM. So, this enzyme methylates catecholamines such as dopamine, norepinephrine, epinephrine, and it also methylates levodopa, right? COM inhibitors are used to decrease the action of COM so that it cannot act upon dopamine, norepinephrine, and epinephrine. So, it's actually a counterpart of MAO inhibitors, right? They will be having the same action, that is, degradation of amines that is catecholamines or amines monoamines etc 
so they were used in treating anxiety disorders parkinson disorder ocd bipolar disorder social anxiety atypical depression etc so the main comp inhibitors used are entacapone nebicapone nitecapone opicapone tolcapone drugs ending with p o n e you can you have you can study all the drugs which are ending with almost p o n e that is almost sometimes capones are also used that is c a p o n e drugs ending with capone all capones belong to comp inhibitors and there are some capones which are not belonging to this actual compt inhibitors but they do have a several actions so almost drugs ending with pone you can convert it into compt inhibitor so this is the function of compt inhibitors in the periphery entacapone and opicapone are peripheral inhibitors and unable to cross the blood brain barrier tolcapone is able to close the blood brain barrier has also many problems with this liver hepatotoxic highly hepatotoxic tolcapone entacapone and opicapone have not been associated with hepatotoxicity these are the three points you have to study for this drug so if you want to see the mono i mean oxidase and its inhibitors you can see my mao and mao inhibitors video i'll be providing the link in the description box if you haven't subscribed my channel please subscribe like and share thank you guys one more thing these are the side effects of comp inhibitors thank you all for that